Hello there, chaps. I haven't done one of these in a while, I know. Sorry about any background noise, it's bonfire night. Um, so fireworks. Uh, I originally had planned to have a little stop motion with my Lego figure in the background of the video, but I've been working on another stop motion. I hope to, uh, I hope to release it tomorrow, if all goes to plan. If I'm releasing this on Saturday tomorrow, if not Sunday. There's a couple of things I want to cover in the video, so let us commence forth with that, shall we? First off, uh, you may have noticed I've been uploading a lot more frequently, and it's all in stop motions, which is great. I'm trying to do weekly stop motions, and while I haven't been incredibly successful so far, I missed a week uh, in October, but I was also having to get a pass. Uh, I'm going to try and continue these weekly stop motions for the rest of the year, and into next year. Uh, I'll be doing something like my Halloween extravaganza, uh, that's the top video there on screen, as you, as you can read. As you can't read. But in December, with all... But the same as the extravaganza, but in December, with all Christmas stop motions for the month, uh, which should be great. It feels crazy that it's December next month, though, doesn't it? Uh, this next part is very exciting, I think. Uh, next weekend will mark one year since I uploaded the first episode of Squad 66. Squad 6 is very important both for this channel and for me. It really started my uh, stop motion making and this uh, stop motion making uh, journey on YouTube. Uh, and this video will be all six episodes combined into one video with just a couple little changes in there. Uh, so it's not just entirely the same thing. Uh, it's half an hour, so double the length of Lego Venom. And it's going to be uh, a really good video, I think. Really fun to see it all in one go. All, all in one video. Also, I think it's logical to mention that I'm going to be making some sequels to Squad 66. Uh, I have, I'm going to make a movie, then a second series, and another movie. Uh, I'm not sure when they're released, but the first movie will probably be around 2023 or 2024. Because uh, I have some other things I want to get out first. Another uh, big, rather big stop motion I plan to release this month is Boyer Wars. It's a retelling of the Star Wars prequels, but it's a story out of snips. And it should be good for everyone to watch. But it'll be a big love letter, I guess, to the Snups community. I think that's the right phrase, love letter. Since Snups has been shut down recently, I already made an, uh, a stop motion called Obi Spider Kenobi vs. Coin Slot. And that'll be in this too, since I think mean, that'd be cool. And it says me to answer the film in the same fight, but I, might, I, would make, made it, I would have made it differently for Boyle Wars, but I've already got the fight, the fight scene. Uh, so why bother changing it? Um. So yeah, that'll be released at the end of the month, if all goes to plan, I need to start writing it. Uh, but yeah, if you were on Snups, uh, you're, I'll, I'll, and I have contact with you, I will ask you to be in the video. Yeah. It's the third time I'm trying to record this segment, because both times my idiotic sister has barged into the room, talking in this stupid why you're speaking, which is idiotic words I hate and I refuse to say. Anyway, I wanted to finish off this video by talking about my plans for next year, 2022. In case you didn't know that, I have big plans for next year. They're the stop motions, what I call the big ones. Um, so far, I've released two Squad is Six and Lego Venom. I'm sure, well, I've released a couple that are longer than some episodes of Squad 66. But, you know, Squad 6 is half an hour altogether, like I said earlier. Anyway, uh, they're part of this universe I'm making called the LWU, Lego Worlds Universe. That title makes sense in a couple of years. When I release Lego Worlds, clever, aren't I? Um, next year, I plan to double the amount of big ones. Uh, in the first half of the year, I'll be releasing an original film called Lego Dragon Master. It's about Clive Connors, modern detective, and he becomes a dragon. The Dragon Master. As you can tell by the title. Uh, it's a basic, most basic way of explaining the plot, and I think it's going to be my best one so far. Um, and around the one year anniversary of Lego Venom, I'll be releasing the sequel, Lego Venom, A Sinister Error. Um, it takes place... That was a big firework I just heard. It takes place, I think we decided, because I have a team for this one, or I, uh, or I've been writing it, but I've been talking with some chaps. Um, it takes place about two months, I think we said, two weeks or two months after the uh, first film. Um, yeah, I don't want to talk too much about the plot, because it could have some big changes. Um, 
and also I think I I want to just kind of keep this one more under wraps like I did with the originals plot. Uh, I have started writing Lego Dragon Master and wrote, and wrote a first draft for Lego Venom too. But I think I'm going to rewrite it and add some things I thought of since then because I wrote it before Lego Venom was even two weeks old. Um, the second half of the year will be more similar to this year. One thing that will be returning is the Halloween Extravaganza. But other than that. I don't know. Uh, I'm considering making a series about Clive Connors, one of the detective. As mentioned, he's the main character in Dragon Master. Uh, and I might be making a Spider-Man movie. Uh, I'm going to make one eventually, but it might be next year. I'm not sure. But, anyway. Just trying to get this video done as quickly as possible because I took some of my stupid scissors and walked barging again. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching through this. I think this year and next year will be really exciting. Uh, and for all the years I'm on this channel making stop motions. I have a lot planned for the future of this channel, but I can't wait to make for all of you. Uh, like and subscribe if you want. I haven't said that in a while. Bye.